Tree is quite the ordeal for this little boy. Ethan had surgery earlier this morning for his injuries sustained in that crash. His father tells me he seems to be in good spirits as his road to recovery now begins. This is eight year old Ethan Rollins still smiling despite a cast on each leg and spending his Christmas in the hospital. It said this is uh, the worst Christmas and it wasn't something he put on his list. Jack's Cross, Ethan's father, says his son had just spent Christmas morning at his house in Raymond and was picked up by his mother to continue his holiday celebrations in Manchester. The two were traveling in a car with a few others heading towards the intersection of Chestnut and Salmon Streets when all of a sudden they were struck uh, by a driver um, and uh, everyone in the vehicle was injured. Ethan bore the brunt of the impact. He had a broken right femur uh, and a broken left ankle. The left ankle was less of a concern, uh, but the femur was broken and separated. So police say the driver of the other car pulled out into the intersection and did not see the vehicle Ethan was traveling in. Ethan was rushed to Catholic Medical Center in Manchester and later transported to Dartmouth Hitchcock in Lebanon, where he underwent surgery this morning. They just re finished pinning it and uh, putting him back together, and uh, he's sleeping right now. Described as an avid sports lover, the injuries will end Ethan's basketball season and will force him off his feet for some time. But his dad says, despite all that, he is lucky to still have his son. So, uh, and the outpour of support from everybody has been, been immense and, and very well appreciated. And now Ethan's family was hoping to get him home tonight, but it appears he may have to spend at least one more night in the hospital. Now, as for the driver at fault involved in this accident, he was given a summons for failure to yield the right of way. Live in the studio, I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.